Uh, good afternoon, all the way from the Dominican Republic, right outside of Bonnie here at the beautiful Restoration Ranch with uh, Danny and Denise Stone and this wonderful work that's going on down here. We're with a team and I just want to give you an update of what's been happening in the last couple of days. We arrived here on Friday and got settled in and got here into the dorms behind me. Of course, this is the first time any of our teams have actually slept in the dorms back here. And it's uh, been really great because we're now actually sleeping right in the rooms where these beautiful children are going to be. And uh, it's really, we're really excited because we know that we're close. Uh, Saturday, we started out in the morning with a medical outreach which was our first real day here on the mission field. And uh, some of our team, Lauren and uh, Victoria and some of the others were inside helping out with medical crew, uh, taking blood pressure and pulses and praying for people. And the rest of our team was actually outside doing children evangelism all the way up to the age of 21, 22 years old. We had kids of all ages and young adults and we're just playing games with them and sharing the love of Christ with them. And, Seth was doing a basketball clinic and all of the kids were just having a great time. You're going to see some, some video of that. And it was just a precious time of laughter and fun and loving on God's precious people here in the Dominican. And then we went later on to a children's outreach. And it's a church entirely made up of children that started years ago when a woman just decided to share the love of Christ uh, with some of her neighbor children or some, some of the children that work, work um, for her husband and it's grown where they have uh, sometimes upwards of 100, 120 children come. Brother Chip Ashman uh, was just a big kid. He had a great time and just played all sorts of fun games with him. And then um, yesterday, Sunday, we had a time of praise and worship in the morning and we uh, just really went before God and God's presence fell with the group here. And then we went, took, a, took an opportunity to go let the kids dip their feet into El Mar Caribe, the Caribbean Sea, and where they went and were able to see that beautiful, beautiful mass of ocean. And uh, from there came back here and got ready and headed out to uh, Pastor Ezra Kelly's church, Ezra and Ellen, Ellen Kelly, uh, right in Santa Rosa, which is right outside of Bani, a community there, where they have poured their heart out to the community and they're raising up uh, an army and generation of young people. Um, it's really their heart. And we ministered, we sang, I preached, and then our team prayed and poured out to the people there. They were so hungry, and our team, every single one of them, was praying and just imparting the love of God and God's power and anointing and presence into the lives of those that came for prayer. And it was just absolutely awesome. God gave uh, Seth some prophetic words, and God gave uh, Brother Chip and, and Scott Fisher, and they just, I was so proud. They went after it and allowed God to use them there. And it was really a neat beginning of some great things that are gonna happen with the Harvest team. And now here to, uh, this morning, um, Monday morning, we went right to work here on the ranch. We have been moving dirt piles, we have been shoveling and wheelbarrowing and trying to get basically the front part of the building here ready for some landscaping, which will be happening here in a couple weeks. And so we're basically just getting rid of piles of gravel and dirt and sand that were left behind from the building project and trying to grade it out. And we've got another team here back behind the camera that is um, pulling out thorns and getting rid of bushes that are poisonous to the goat herd here. And uh, actually, one of the teams is clearing an area that will eventually be a baseball field. And as you know, uh, nine out of 10 Dominican boys, uh, their dream is to play Major League Baseball in the States, to literally bat their way out of the island. And so to be able to, to be clearing that and working here, um, we're literally paving the way for futures to be brighter with these young people. So this is an exciting thing that's going on here. I wanted to give you an update and let you know what's happening. And we just love you guys, can't wait to be back. Your kids are safe and sound, they're all in one piece. And God is moving with them in a mighty way. God bless you.